Hi, this is Serge and welcome back to my YouTube music vlog here at the Nostalgia Channel where we bring back the memories. A few episodes ago, we reacted to the original version of MacArthur Park by Mr. Richard Harris. Park was written and composed by Mr. Jimmy Webb. So in September 1978, Queen of Disco Donna Summer released her discofied version of MacArthur Park and it went all the way to number one on the Billboard Hot 100. It earned for Miss Summer her first nomination as Best Pop Vocal Female in the Grammy Awards and she was also nominated for favorite pop rock female in the American Music Awards. Her album Live and More took home the award for favorite disco album. Donna became the first artist in the modern era to have a number one album Live and More and a number one song MacArthur Park simultaneously become number one on the Billboard charts. That was the week of November 11, 1978. So according to Italian producer Giorgio Moroder, he was thinking of a song that he could reinvent and he heard MacArthur Park on the radio and he quickly asked president of Casablanca Records to get a copy of the song. So the Richard Harris version served as Marauder's basis for the envisioned disco-fied reinvention of MacArthur Park by Giorgio Marauder. So Marauder said that MacArthur Park would be a great song for Donna. With all those high notes, it was perfect for her. He wanted a key where she could sing really high but then still have that big voice. Also, Mr. Marauder created something special. He was the one who did the choir using his own voice as backup for Summer's vocals. According to Marauder, it was a very, very difficult song to arrange because of all the brass. But then he said that he had all the great musicians behind him and supporting him. So let's listen to the live version of MacArthur Park from June 2004 in the UK from Disco Mania. I just love the arrangement of this song. It perfectly captures the energy of the original. There's also nothing like a live performance with a very enthusiastic audience. Amazing high note. Oh, no. oh, no. 
It was such an amazing live performance. And I would like to repeat that amazing high note. It's amazing. One more time. Perfect. One last time. It's amazing. That's great vocal power. So thank you very much. I enjoy that high note so much. Thank you very much to Mr. Jimmy Webb for composing that song. The great Donna Summer for her fantastic and impeccable vocal delivery. Powerful vocals. So please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. As Casey Kasem said, keep your feet on the ground and keep reaching for the stars. Let's bring back the memories here at the Nostalgia Channel. Thank you and God bless.